All right, everyone. Today we're working on the uh, 98 Camry, and uh, we are going to replace the window regulator because it's uh, not not working. It goes down, but doesn't want to come up. Well, there's uh, three fasteners, or four, I should say, fasteners you have to take out. One is here, and that one, just take a screwdriver or something small, or go in that little corner and pop it out. And then you will see you will see a screw, and this one is broken off, so that's no fun. Okay, so that one broke off. But anyway, there's a screw, and then you'll have to reach underneath here and over here, and that broke, so I'll have to buy a new one for that. But anyways, um, there's another plug over here in the door handle that you can uh, ease out, okay, with a little screwdriver, okay, like this. And I actually did it this way, or you can use uh, these plastic tools, and then. Uh, the other one is the the door hand controls. You go from the back side, not the front side, because that's where the clip is. You reach under and you push right in the middle. And then what you'll do is you'll release uh, this clip right there. And then you can pull it on, because here in the front you can see that it's just retained there. And then what you will do is then just basically unclip everything. Like so. Push the tab down and pull out. Same thing for this one. Push, come on. There we go, and those, that's free. All right, and then the last one is the one here in the front. There's a screw underneath this little clip here. And if you were to just take your soft tool and just reach behind it, and hopefully it doesn't break, just like the other stuff did, pull it off. There's a screw right there, okay? So we're gonna release all those, okay? And then we'll be back. Okay, there was also one underneath the armrest, right about here. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little hole. Um, you just put in, a, again, it's a Phillips screwdriver. Uh, the next thing you wanna do is, you know, mine's cracked, so I'll have to order a new one, is you take a little pry tool and you, you, you actually put underneath it here like this, pull it above because there are little clips that you got to get underneath and this one is totally totally gone so I'll have to buy a new one that's gonna be fun and then you pull this out and you pull it out this way so that there's a front clip that you can get around it see around the front there's a front clip so either I'll glue this back together or I'll order a new one they're pretty cheap you can still get these online okay and then you can pull the card off because they're just held in by uh, body clips now. So just pull from the bottom and they should pop right off. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to work underneath. Okay, there's another clip at the end of the door. These are the kind where you just push it in and then this will come out. Okay, and to reset it, you just push push the little pin back out and then you can put it back in and then you know but I forgot to take that out oops and that should be it and then we'll take this piece out okay. let's see there, there's a couple mm-hmm all right on the bottom on the bottom there's a couple more screws here before this will release, so we'll remove that next. All right, now we're finally ready to remove. I don't think there's any more screws here, so we'll pull and see. Let's see, come on. There we go. The bottom screw came out. And this side, and then just pick it up. There we go. And it's free. Okay. I'm gonna put that in the back seat. I'm gonna put it on top of the car. Alright, so let's get down to the regulator. <coughs> uh, you can tell on that pull I broke this clip off here, so we're gonna have to replace that with another generic clip, but uh, that's it. That was the only one. Yeah, the other ones came out. That one broke, so oops, it easy. All right, so what we're gonna do next is we're going to uh, open this 
panel here. I'm going to remove the three screws. Hopefully we'll have access to the motor. That's my finger. That ain't gonna. That hurts. Okay, pick up everything. Keep that together over there. And then we should be able to pull this tab back and we should have access to the stuff right behind it, okay? All right, let's see. There we go. Let's see right there. Mm -hmm. Let's see, pull. Yeah, I'm kind of gooey. Okay, and then we're just gonna put it right here like this and attach it to itself. You see, right here, these are the three mounting screws. Four, I should say, mounting screws and the clip for that um, regulator. And so, here's the regulator. And we're gonna have to lower the window so you can get to the point. If you couldn't lower the window, then um, you're gonna have a little more problems. But there's two, and then there's another one over here on this side. That you'll have to uh, undo okay it looks like it's about a 10 millimeter i would say um and then we're gonna try to we're gonna lower the window and see if we can get the uh the, the glass off of the track first and then we'll work on replacing the regulator okay